Okay, here we have to find the second derivative. Let's first find the first derivative. Using product rule, you get cosine of x times by tangent of x plus sine of x. Differentiate that, and we get um, the secant squared x. Okay, so let's see if we can clean this up a, a bit here. Not really, right? We can't factor anything out, so let's go straight into the second derivative. Differentiate that, you get minus sine x tangent of x plus cosine of x. Differentiate that, we get secant squared x. So now we're done with the derivative of that. Now let's differentiate this again. Using product rule, you get cosine of x secant squared x plus sine of x multiplied by the derivative of that, which is going to be, first of all, 2 secant x. And then we have to chain that by the derivative of secant of x, which is secant of x tangent of x. That's the derivative of secant of x. So let's try to simplify a little bit here. I think we can collect these two. And this right here is uh, a plus 2 sine of x, a secant squared x, and a tangent of x.